We're all used to the idea that light travels faster than sound. Think about thunderstorms. You always see the lightning before you hear the thunder, despite the fact that they both occur at the same time. Sound travels at approximately 330 meters per second, which is pretty fast. However, man has been able to beat this speed and break the sound barrier with supersonic travel. The incredible thing about breaking the sound barrier is that it not only produces an audible effect, but also a visible one. Take a look at this picture. You can actually see the effect on the air as the plane blasts through the sound barrier. Isn't that amazing? The reason why this occurs is because as the plane travels through the air, it pushes the air out of the way, which creates pressure waves that travel at the speed of sound. This is similar to the waves created by the bow and stern of a boat as it moves through the water. As the plane approaches the sound barrier, the air cannot get out of the way quick enough and it is squashed together into one big shock wave that is travelling at the speed of sound. This shock wave begins at the nose of the plane and ends at the tail in steady flight. It forms a kind of cone shape that surrounds the plane, as can be seen here. The pressure inside the cone is not that much greater than normal air pressure. However, since this overpressure is released very quickly, it is audible as a sonic boom. Have a listen to one. There are actually two booms that are produced, one at the nose and one at the tail which you can see in this video. However, they usually pass over observers almost at the same time, and so most people will only hear one. It's not just fighter jets that can produce a sonic boom. Perhaps the most famous form of transport that could break the sound barrier was Concorde, which was a commercial airliner before it was put out of use in 2003. Space shuttles can also break the sound barrier, but only when they re-enter the Earth's atmosphere. Well, that's all we have time for except for this last fact. Humans are actually able to produce a sonic boom using their hands. The crack of a bullwhip is actually a sonic boom. This is because the end of it is travelling faster than the speed of sound. Now that's fun. Well that's all for today. Until next time remember, science is fun.